A new chapter in military history is unfolding in the skies, with Russia's Su-57 fighter jet at the center. This isn't just another powerful aircraft, it's a leap in technology. The Su-57 is a fifth-generation stealth fighter, designed to be nearly invisible to enemy radar. It combines speed, agility and advanced electronics, symbolizing Russia's modern military ambitions. Built to rival the American F-22 and F-35, its development has drawn global attention. But the story intensifies with the arrival of the 3M22 Zircon hypersonic missile. Hypersonic means speeds over five times the speed of sound, making interception nearly impossible. Pairing the Su-57 with the Zircon missile isn't just an upgrade, it's a game-changer for aerial combat. This combination could redefine the rules of engagement, giving one side a massive advantage. We'll explore what makes the Su-57 and Zircon so special, and how their integration creates a weapon system greater than the sum of its parts. This isn't just about technology, it's about shifting the global balance of military power. Nations are now rethinking their defense strategies in response. For military planners, the Su-57 armed with Zircon presents a daunting challenge. How do you defend against an enemy you can't see, who can strike from hundreds of miles away with a weapon you can't intercept? The answers are far from simple. This fusion of stealth and hypersonic speed marks the dawn of a new arms race. The world is watching, as nations scramble for faster weapons, better detection, and new strategies. The Su-57 and Zircon are setting the pace for the future of aerial warfare. The stakes have never been higher. To grasp the significance of the Zircon missile, we first need to understand hypersonic speed, anything above Mach 5 or 5 times the speed of sound. Commercial jets cruise at less than Mach 1, even the fastest fighters rarely exceed Mach 2.5. Hypersonic weapons operate in a different league, with speeds that overwhelm current defenses. Most air defense systems are built to counter slower threats like planes or cruise missiles. Hypersonic missiles cover vast distances in minutes, leaving defenders with almost no time to react. There are two main types, hypersonic glide vehicles which are launched high and glide down at extreme speeds, and hypersonic cruise missiles like the Zircon powered by scramjet engines for sustained hypersonic flight. The Zircon's low-altitude high-speed path makes it even harder to detect and intercept. Defending against these weapons is a massive challenge, not just because of their speed but also their maneuverability. Unlike ballistic missiles, hypersonic missiles can change course mid-flight and hug the terrain to avoid radar. This unpredictability, combined with extreme speed, makes interception nearly impossible with today's technology. That's why nations are pouring billions into both developing hypersonic weapons and finding ways to defend against them. The race is on to adapt to this new threat. Hypersonic technology is reshaping military priorities worldwide. The stakes are high, and the pace of innovation is relentless. The Zircon is at the forefront of this revolution. Understanding its basics is key to understanding the future of warfare. The 3M22 Zircon is Russia's cutting-edge hypersonic cruise missile, designed to shatter naval defenses. Its main target high-value warships like aircraft carriers, the core of modern navies. The Zircon's scramjet engine enables relentless hypersonic flight, making it a nearly unstoppable threat. Unlike traditional missiles, the Zircon can skim just above the ocean's surface, evading radar until the last seconds. By the time it's detected, it's almost too late for any defense. Its guidance system combines inertial navigation with an active radar seeker for pinpoint accuracy, even against moving targets. The missile's low-altitude approach exploits the Earth's curvature, hiding it from radar until impact is imminent. This advanced guidance allows it to strike ships at sea with deadly precision. The Zircon's design is all about speed, stealth, and surprise. It's a weapon built to break through the most advanced naval shields. With each test, Russia has refined its capabilities, making the Zircon a true game-changer. Its integration with platforms like the Su-57 multiplies its threat. The world's navies are now forced to rethink their defenses. The Zircon is redefining what it means to control the seas. The Zircon's numbers are staggering. Mach 9, or over 11,000 kilometers per hour. That's three times faster than a rifle bullet. At this speed, it can strike a target a thousand kilometers away in under 10 minutes. Traditional ship defenses, built for slower threats, are left with only seconds to respond. The missile's range allows its launch platform, be it ship, submarine, or Su-57, 
to stay far from enemy defenses. This standoff capability means attackers can strike from safety, while defenders scramble to react. The combination of long range and hypersonic speed gives the Zircon strategic importance. A single aircraft armed with Zircon can threaten entire fleets or critical land targets from afar. Adversaries are forced to change tactics, operating further from coastlines and investing in new costly defenses. The Zircon compresses the timeline of battle, leaving little room for error. Its speed and range together reshape the modern battlefield. The missile's presence alone can alter military planning and deterrence. It's not just a weapon, it's a strategic tool. The Zircon's reach and velocity are rewriting the rules of engagement. Defending against it is a challenge few are ready to meet. The future of warfare is moving at hypersonic speed. The Sukhoi Su-57 or Felon is Russia's answer to the world's top fighter jets. As a fifth-generation aircraft, it boasts stealth, supercruise, and advanced avionics. Its stealth design minimizes radar detection, letting it approach targets unseen. Special materials and angled surfaces deflect radar, making it far harder to track than older fighters. The Su-57's three-dimensional thrust vectoring engines give it unmatched agility, allowing extreme maneuvers in dogfights. This super maneuverability, combined with stealth, makes it a formidable opponent. Its avionics suite includes ASA radar arrays for instant 360-degree situational awareness. All data is fused and displayed for the pilot, maximizing combat effectiveness. The Su-57 is a flying supercomputer, built for both air superiority and ground attack. It's the spearhead of Russia's modernized air force. The Su-57's design balances stealth, speed, and agility, prioritizing flexibility over pure invisibility. Its internal weapons bays preserve stealth while carrying a range of munitions, including the powerful Zircon missile. Advanced avionics go beyond radar with electronic warfare systems that jam enemy sensors and create a protective electronic bubble. An infrared search and track system lets the Su-57 detect targets passively, without revealing its position. These systems work together, making the Su-57 a deadly hunter. The pilot can detect, approach, and strike before being seen. Launching a Zircon from stealth, the Su-57 can hit and escape undetected. This integration of sensors, stealth, and firepower defines fifth-generation fighters. The Su-57 is built to dominate the modern battlefield. Pairing the Su-57 with the Zircon missile creates a weapon system with unmatched offensive power. The Su-57 stealth lets it slip past defenses and reach optimal launch points undetected. Once in position, it can unleash the Zircon, which covers the remaining distance at Mach 9. Even if detected at launch, it's too late for defenders to react. This combination can penetrate the most advanced naval and land-based defenses. Carrier strike groups, once considered nearly invulnerable, are now at risk. The Su-57 can bypass patrols and early warning systems, launching Zircon from outside enemy missile range. Land targets, command centers, air defenses, infrastructure are equally vulnerable. The pairing creates a powerful strategic deterrent, holding high-value assets at risk. It forces adversaries to rethink their entire approach to defense. The Su-57 and Zircon together are more than a sum of their parts they're a new kind of threat. This synergy is changing the calculus of modern warfare. The world is taking notice. The Su-57 and Zircon combination is more than a tactical upgrade. It's a strategic shift. It challenges decades of Western air superiority, forcing a global rethink of defense strategies. Existing missile defense systems struggle against hypersonic threats, risking obsolescence. Nations must now invest in new sensors and interceptors sparking a costly arms race. The psychological impact is profound. Knowing an adversary has an unstoppable weapon changes decision-making. This is the essence of anti-access slash area denial, making vast regions too risky for enemy forces. The Su-57 and Zircon are perfect tools for this, limiting adversary options. As Russia advances, others must follow. China and the US are racing to develop their own hypersonic arsenals. The competition is about more than weapons, it's about new doctrines and strategies. The arrival of this system accelerates global military modernization. The era of hypersonic deterrence has begun. The Su-57 and Zircon missile mark a turning point in aerial warfare. 
This isn't just an upgrade, it's a disruptive leap that changes air combat's very nature. The Su-57's stealth and sensors let it strike unseen. The Zircon's speed makes defense nearly impossible. Together, they compress reaction times and overwhelm even the best defenses. This synergy is already reshaping global strategy and fueling a new arms race. The future of air dominance will be defined by those who master stealth, speed, and precision. The skies are more dangerous than ever, and the world is racing to adapt. The age of hypersonic aerial combat is here.